a limit day. One, two, three, four, a limit day. <laughs> I'm Lee. I manage one of the hottest spots on the Vegas Strip. My job has made me an expert at making people happy, comfortable, and well entertained. That lends itself really well in the dating game. Finding a beautiful woman in Vegas is easy. Finding one that has any character, well, that's actually the hard part. I'm looking for a girl that has goals and has ambition and has some sort of direction with her life. And I'm hoping one of these girls is going to be it. A limit day. For round one, I thought we'd play a little pool. I want to see which girl goes out there and shows me what she's got. I need to be with someone that appreciates dancing and all that because I love doing that no matter where I'm at. I'm Tracy and I'm a dancer at the Shadow Bar in Caesars Palace. Hi. I'm Tracy. Hi, I'm Lee. Nice to meet you. you. Nervous? I'm oh, extremely. <laughs> He's cute. He's definitely cute. He's got really pretty green eyes too. I have bigger muscles and a better body than most of the guys I meet, and I think that intimidates them. I'm Danielle, and I'm a circus acrobat. How you doing? Lee. Danielle. Nice to meet you. Dating in Las Vegas is easy because there are so many gorgeous guys here. It's being in a relationship that's hard because you're constantly being tempted. Hi, I'm Jackie, and I'm a personal trainer. How you doing? Hey. I'm Lee. I'm Jackie. Nice to meet you. She's definitely a Vegas girl. Great body, great tan, uh, bleach blonde hair. A lot of fun, probably. When I first saw Lee, I was glad because I like the bad boy type. I'm beautiful, I'm very outgoing, and I'm a self-made woman. What more do you want? My name is Tamara, and I'm a real estate agent in Las Vegas. Well, hello. Hi. Hi. Okay. Camera. I'm Lee. Nice to meet you. Yeah. All right. I'm going to go this way. Let me play some pool. Actually. So, uh, what do you do? I teach boxing aerobics at Gold's Gym. You teach boxing at Gold's Gym? Uh, and, and I'm a personal trainer. Personal trainer. Yeah. In my spare time, I go out of town a lot. I go to L.A. and hang out. What do you do when you're in L.A.? I had it in for Jackie, just by her kind of showing up. Her attitude was real, like, snotty and, you know what? She's just an old lady. So what do you do for a living? I dance salsa, and then on the weekends, it's just cage dancing, it's all go-go. So what do you do for a living? <laughs> I sell real estate mm -hmm. for many years. and sold real estate all my life. My whole family's in real estate. When Tamara said that she was a real estate agent, it was a definite plus in my book, because I like a girl with a career. So what about you? Uh, I'm a circus acrobat. Circus acrobat? Yes. Can you show me something that you do? I would like to, but I'm in a skirt, so I don't know how much I can show you. What can you show me? I think when Lee saw me bend backwards like that, he was probably wondering, hmm, I wonder what else she can do. A back bend? from a more feminine person would definitely be a lot more appealing. I'm not sure if Lee is looking for someone that could bench press more than he can. I noticed how Tamara stuck the cue between her breasts, trying to impress him, but I don't see how it would. Her breasts look terrible. On the one hand, I was definitely turned on by what Tamara did, but on the other, it really made me question what kind of a girl she is. If you sink this shot, you can ask one of the other girls an embarrassing question. Oh, Yay! Nice. Woo! Uh -huh. See, I'm good. I know yeah. what I'm doing. I have a question for you. Yeah. Okay, where do you get your outfit and your clothes and where do you shop in this Everywhere. Area? LA mostly. Okay. I went in for Jackie because she was a very easy target. Her clothes looked like she got them out of a garbage dumpster. And um she looks like she's been partying for 40 years straight. What's that's, wrong with my outfit? At least you have more clothes on. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, what was that? Mm. I'm sorry. Yeah, you know just what? curious. It, looks, it kind of looks like you might need me to train you a little bit. <laughs> really? As a matter of fact, I train at the same gym you do, and I've never seen you there. Really? Yeah. Well, that's surprising. My classes only have 80 people in them. Oh, okay. Well, must be Come check it out sometime. I did not expect to get treated so bad by Tamara. First of all, I think that is so classless. 
to, I'll to agree be with you fighting that. in the first place mm -hmm. or even acting like we're acting. That girl has to grasp at anything because she has nothing. Her stomach is hanging out of her tube top. Her boobs look lopsided. She's hanging out of everything she's wearing and she's gonna talk about me. I, why would we be a good match, do you think? Because he just, we just looked like we would have a trailer. <coughs> oh, wow. cheated. That's what I was thinking about you. Yeah. Yeah. Really. So I think the cattiness between Tamara and Jackie was definitely uncalled for. It made everyone uncomfortable. Air was definitely thick in there. I know this is probably not a normal date for everybody. How long did it take you guys to get ready? Because I know I was like nervous, didn't know what to wear. Well, I'm naturally beautiful, so it doesn't take me long at all. Should be eliminated first. So, so uh, I was just honey, are you old Wait. enough? To, you're a little old for the show, don't you think? Oh, and really? him, by far. Th yeah, that's, that that's sad. If I if I am older than you and I look better than you, what's your problem? You think with that bleach blonde hair and those lovely older. wrinkles? What's wrong with bleach blonde hair? Uh, well, well your roots are a little tacky. Natural? I don't think yours. Is it is either. actually mostly Thank natural. You. I have highlights. You have trailer hair. There was so much catfighting going on, it was definitely fun just to sit back and watch them go at it. You're like, what, 45, 50, like, 45? You're just like trying to find something wrong with me, aren't you? No, it's actually very easy. <gasps> it is. Yeah. Okay, what is? My belly's hanging so, out like yours. <laughs> my boobs are sagging like yours. No, you just don't have I, any. My you just don't have any taste. Do you want to go <gasps> well, I know I look better than her. And I hate to even say that, but girl. I, I hate to even say it because you know it's not true. Oh my God, because I think that's so mean, but I do look better than you. Please. I have no fat hanging over my stomach. I, I, have, I have fat? I have no fat. Oh my god, girl. You need to take a look in the mirror. I'm sorry, but... So anyway. It's time for the first cut. Will it be Tamara, Danielle, Jackie, or Tracy? At least you just eliminate Jackie first. She's always been out for 40 years straight, but she needs to get back to bed. I honestly think that uh, Jackie's gonna get cut this round just because she didn't have a lot going for her. I think that Jackie's probably gonna get cut first. If I could kickbox somebody's ass out of this first round, it would definitely be Miss Piggy. Eliminate. <laughs> it's time for the first cut. Will it be Tamara, Danielle, Jackie, or Tracy? Well, I just want to say that I had a really great time with everybody today. But you guys know the name of the show, so got to eliminate someone. It's a very, very tough decision, but who I'm eliminating is Danielle. I cut Danielle because I felt like from the beginning she really wasn't into the whole date. She was really quiet and really wasn't into me. I think that Lee made a really big mistake in not choosing me because he gave up the, the most natural and real girl of the group. She was just uh, not really into him. She's not fighting for him. She doesn't want him like I do. Sorry, Danielle. Back to the circus you go. I think Lee has a few difficult decisions ahead of him as far as the girls he's stuck with because, in all honesty, I don't see any of them as his type. For the next round, I'm taking the girls to a strip club. I want to see how these girls react to the other women stripping. I want to see if one of them will get up on the pole. I just want to see what they're going to do. As soon as we pulled up to Cheetahs, I was so happy. I was like, yeah, this is my kind of thing, because I like to get crazy, and this was my time to shine. I was a little nervous. In the back of my head, I was so worried that they were going to have me get up there and dance. So you would have no problem with your boyfriend going out with his friends to a club or even a strip club? Well, when I go out to a club, my last boyfriend, I buy him dances and I like seeing that. Oh, really? I, I enjoy that very much, yes. And when we're all partying with my friends, it's just a regular club. Uh, my friends hang all over my boyfriend. Has it ever gone further than that with any of your boyfriends? Um, yes. What happened? Everything. I don't think that's right. <laughs> If you got a man, I don't think he's sheriff. So you guys want to go see some dancers? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. I'm really going to be watching to see how secure the women are with themselves and if they get intimidated by the strippers. And if any of these girls start working the club for tips, they're out of here. So as soon as the dancers came out, Jackie pretty much pushed me out of the way to tip the girls. Tracy pretty much clammed up and it definitely wasn't scoring her any points. Everyone's hard. There you go. Yeah, baby. Woo! I think 
think Tamara's a little obsessed with her breasts. She's doing everything she can to have them in everyone's face. Putting them on top of Lee's head, wearing the low shirt and all that. So I'm sitting there, I'm watching the dancers on stage, and all of a sudden I've got these two monstrous breasts on each side of my face. She comes up behind her with her big old boobs and is like <laughs> knocking them in the head with them, practically knocking them unconscious. I mean, that was nasty. <laughs> I'm looking to see if any of these women are brave enough to get up on stage. I want to see if they can be sexy, but still be innocent. I'll, I'll take care of you while you're up there. <laughs> surprise, surprise, Jackie throws herself on her back, with dollar bills down her shirt. Boy, do you think she's all lesbian? Hello? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ready? Gotta give Tamara credit. She knows what she wants, she knows how to get it. She's just All right, so much. When I did my little pole dance for Lee, I was checking to make sure that uh, it had the right effect, and trust me, it did. When Tamara got up on stage with the other two girls, I was impressed with her abilities, but it made me wonder if maybe she does it part time. Tamara's strip tease attempt definitely made me just cringe. I couldn't even look, I was embarrassed for them. When Tamara kissed him up on the stage, Miss Piggy, I was like, she has to get close because she cannot back up and let him see her body because then he will definitely eliminate her. Tracy is acting like she was like Miss Goody too. She's she needs to wake up and realize that she's in Vegas, not in Kansas. Just the atmosphere makes you nervous. I mean, there's half naked girls all around you, and there's a pole in front of you, and it's kind of more of a raunchy scene. Yes. Jackie was great. She had a lot of fun, a lot of enthusiasm. I definitely like that in a girl. Definitely think that Jackie in past life might have uh, been a stripper. You're on my tit, and it does hurt if they're real. <laughs> For her to straddle him and sit on his lap, all 400 pounds of her, and I feared for his life. All right. I was trying to give him this sexy, sensual lap dance, and then I noticed Tamara coming up and sticking her nasty tongue in his ear, licking it like she's like licking some nasty pork chop, but that's probably because she likes all that greasy food, obviously. I had Jackie in my lap, I had Tamara's boobs in my face. I didn't even know where Tracy was. Which one of these girls will be the next to go? I think that uh, Jackie would probably be the one to get cut for this round because I was kind of watching Lee's reactions when she was talking about hooking up with the girls. I just don't think he was impressed. I definitely think that Tracy will get cut in this round because she really doesn't even want to be here. Jackie locks me up because I'm mean to her. Well, I'm sorry. I call it as I see it. She's no hey. A limit day. <laughs> One of these girls is about to be eliminated. Will it be Tamara, Tracy, or Jackie? I want to tell you guys, round two was amazing. That was every guy's fantasy and I had a great time. You all did a really, really good job. Thank you. And I had to make the hardest decision. I've been going back and forth. I didn't know what I was going to do, but I had to make a cut. Tamara, I had a lot of fun with you. You have great energy. You were really into the show, and I felt like you were really into me. I think we would have a great time. Like, we could go totally hang out. You know what I mean? I totally would. But if it came to like a more of a serious relationship, I think, I think we would have a little bit different priorities. So. OK. Well, you girls have a great time tonight. Ah! That's, that's, that's cool. Thank you. Oh, that's fine. I felt that Tamara was making it pretty difficult for everybody to have a good time and relax. To make herself look better, she was attacking the other girls, and I didn't really like that. I am so excited. I can't even believe it. I just want to have fun. I don't even want to deal with her attitude the rest of the night. We can all at least get together, or get along together and have fun. So we don't have to be worrying about someone cutting on us all the time and all the negative energy. I'm really shocked about his decision. Okay, let's just keep rolling on the walk. No, let's life. not. We're done. That's it. Okay. Cut the camera.
Made such a crazy round two. Thought I would bring it down a little bit, chill out in a luxury suite in the Paris Hotel, have some champagne, and get to know each other a little better. I'm just a little wound up. I want to try to relax, maybe make my decision a little easier if you could like help me relax, maybe by giving me a massage. If you could do that. Directed at me? Yeah. I think I could do that. Help me relax, maybe. So do you think you pamper your man? As long as he pampers me too, of course. What about you? Yeah, it has to be. I had one moment of massaging my back, I had the other massaging my hands. I can't imagine anything better. I think I could give you a better massage in the bedroom. I think oh, really? you need to let me show you how to give you a real mm -hmm. massage. Okay. I'm gonna have to. <laughs> <laughs> I did look over in the room and all I could see was her straddled over him on the bed. A lot. I mean, that's pretty good for a first date, definitely. Nothing left to the imagination. Definitely needs to be more aggressive. <laughs> Jack is a very seductive woman, and she used her seductive powers on me. It definitely worked. The kissing on the neck came as a very nice surprise. I wanted to get him on the bed and rip his sweater off of him and look at his chest and kiss him and all that, but I just didn't want to be too aggressive with him. I didn't want to scare him off. All right, I definitely I'm think you had enough so alone good. time. So I'm in the bedroom with Jackie, and things are definitely getting a little steamy. And just about that time, I got Tracy in there dragging me out. Maybe you can come out here. I'd really sit with you on the couch and talk. I'm glad that I went in there and I grabbed him. I got the chance to take him and sit him down and, you know, have some alone time and tell him how I felt. I just want to get this cross before I make a decision, because I'm not aggressive like that. Mm -hmm. I don't show my feelings like that right off the bat, but I want you to know that I'm interested. And I know I probably should have put forth a lot more effort, but I'm not that much of a computer when it comes, when that's too strong mm -hmm. for me. So I'm just hoping you like the lighter side of it. Mm -hmm. so, I, so I was worried that you just weren't into me, you just weren't, didn't want to be there. So that, that definitely wasn't the case? Not at all. Not at all. When Tracy was alone with him, I'm quite sure she didn't say anything she hadn't already said. So what is she was probably boring him to tears, so I, I wasn't even worried about it. I appreciated Tracy opening up to me, but I'm just not sure if it was too little too late. Who will it be, Tracy or Jackie? The final cut is next. A limit day. <laughs> All right, guys, I just want to tell you that I had a great time today. I think both of you are wonderful. You're beautiful. You're a lot of fun. But I've got to cut one of you. <sighs> All right. So I'm picking you, and I'm cutting you. OK. The reason why is that I'm kind of tired of playing the field, so I want to see someone that is a little more serious oriented. I understand. I felt like maybe we were a little closer on the same page that way, and I thought maybe we had a better shot at actually something real. I'm a little surprised and I'm disappointed because I really thought he would pick me. And you know what? He's going to be so bored. I can't even believe he even wants to go out with her. But he's right. I, I'm not looking for a relationship. I'm having fun. Lee, I hope you find your partner that you're looking for. And Tracy, I hope you're happy too. I picked Tracy because she had this innocence and the sweetness about her that I haven't seen in Vegas in a long time and I definitely found that attractive.